In today's video, I'm going to be talking about Luka Doncic and of course how great he is and of course the Olympic preview, of course if he makes the Olympics, I hope he does. Let's get down, let's check out Luka Doncic. So Slovenia is a very good team, they're going to be really doing a lot of screen and rolls for Luka Doncic to get himself a lot of assists, but also what this is going to do for him is it's going to open up the court drastically. So once he starts and once they start scouting him out for those passes to the player who is rolling towards the basket, there's going to be more players who are, of course, not going to be hedging on Luka Doncic, which will allow him to hit those three-point shots quite easily. Here we see another screen and roll, but instead they hedge with a double team where Luka Doncic has the vision to be able to hit that player rolling towards the basket. Teams that are not paying attention, players who are not paying attention to help out with that rolling player are going to get hurt bad. This defender was way out of position. It doesn't matter who he was guarding, he was out of position badly. And teams cannot make that mistake against Luka. Let's not forget that FIBA basketball is a lot more aggressive and they're going to be double teaming Luka like crazy. However, Luka is able to deal with those double teams because he deals with them every Every day in the NBA. So when he gets backed up to half, he's able to deal with a player who is of course playing tight. And then of course even the fake screens, this was great defense coming down to defend that player who was going to be cutting towards the basket. And that really cut off Luka's ability to even pass to that player. Even brought in a third player to try and defend him, but he's able to get up that shot because he's used to those double teams. Here we see another great screen and roll again where there's no players who are helping out. These two players come in to help out but even then we have or at least Slovenia has the ability to be able to have smart players who can cut back door that make these help defenders honest which then allow again easy baskets. Slovenia is going to be a very interesting team to watch. Let's not forget that Luka Doncic has size to his advantage against other guards so even when he does get double teamed by multiple guards he can still pass that ball out of the post for other players to score. Luka Doncic is not just a score only player. He wants to pass and get his team better. And Luka Doncic is also a very good defender. Here he's able to read that pass, get that pass and he's able to go all the way down court take a little bit of a hit and still finish and if players are not going to defend him tightly he's going to jack up those threes from NBA range now remember this three-point line is just a bit less than a three-point line and because of that these players who are playing on other teams that are not in the NBA are probably used to players not being able to shoot all that often from three feet beyond that three-point line this is NBA range about here so for Luka Doncic, that's a normal three-point shot, but to these other players from Angola and around the world, they're not really used to players who can shoot from way back here, and if they do, they're usually probably classified as a bad shot like they are at the youth level here in Canada. Let's also remember that Luka Doncic is used to running against the quick NBA offenses. And if he's going to be able to get into the, the passing lanes here, even though those players may not feel like he's the fastest player, he's going to be able to pick them off, mainly because the NBA game is much faster. And because of that, those passes are a lot more crisp in the NBA, and he may not have been able to even pick that pass off in the NBA if it even went through. It would have been probably a fake pass. That player goes down and loop pass over. But instead, th these players are not NBA-style players in, the most, in most cases, and he's going to be able to pick them off. I also just want to say that Luka Doncic is one of the most underrated defenders in the NBA. He is extremely good. He can finish with dunks. He's, he can read passes. He's just overall really, really good. So that's the scouting report for Slovenia as well as for Luka Doncic. I think that they could have a chance of making the Olympics. Of course, at the time of recording this video, we have we are still in the Olympic qualifying tournaments and they just finished winning a couple of games. So again, hit that like button. Subscribe if you have liked today's video. I hope that this video has helped you become a better basketball player. If it has, again, I'll see you guys in my next video.